another popular way of using AJAX today is in giving users automatic feedback on login attempts. Uh, you can see an example at jamesdan.com slash AJAX login, login.html. Here's what that looks like in a web page. You can try entering a username, a random username, and putting in a password of some type. And if it's incorrect, which this one is, you can, you know, when you click outside the text fields, you get instant feedback without a page refresh using AJAX techniques saying invalid username and password combination. So this is, shows how AJAX can be useful in automatically checking on the user's username and password login attempt, giving them feedback instantly behind the scenes without a page refresh, without a page flicker, and so forth. So it shows another way that AJAX is becoming popular. In this case, you can, the actual password is user, username is user1, and password is pass1. And so after we click outside the these text fields, you should see that you're in fact logged in. So the login process is another one that often involves multi-steps that AJAX is helping with, allowing you to automatically log in and check the user's login attempt on the server, give immediate feedback without a page refresh in the in the web page in which the user is trying to log in. Very handy, very nice way of, of working with AJAX. As a matter of fact, you're going to see an example in this course developed, which looks like this. It asks the user to choose a username, and if that username has already been selected, has already been in use, then you're going to see immediate feedback on how that username has already, has already been taken. Here's an example. Enter your username, and in this case, the username Steve, and when you stop typing, you see a message immediately that says that username is taken, allowing the user to avoid the frustration of a multi-step process of trying to choose a username that's already been taken, where you have a you have to click a button and there's a page refresh, and data comes back from the server and says that name that username is already taken, and you have to start over from scratch. Here, as you see, it's a nice one-step process. As you enter the, your name, your attempted username. The username is sent to the server automatically using AJAX, and if that username is, is already taken, you get immediate feedback, as you see here. The little red uh, or pink box appears. It says that username is taken, and then the user is, is surprised of the fact that that username is not available, so that's a, another way you're going to see AJAX being used increasingly on the Internet, and you can already find many ways, many login pages that use AJAX, as a matter of fact, on the internet these days already. It's going to become an increasingly popular way of working with AJAX. As you see, it can it once again save the user a set of steps and make their, make their process a lot easier.